I'm actually moving at the end of the week. Hands done. Everybody, happy Monday. If you're new here, my name is Milan. I am 22 years old. I just graduated from college and am trying to figure out my life post-grad, so I hope you'll stick around on the journey. So I thought I would document this week. It's a really busy week for me because I'm actually moving at the end of the week, so I have a ton to do. I have a super long to-do list in my planner on this post-it note here. It's about 10 right now. I think I'm gonna knock out a couple of hours of work for my remote job. Oh, we have a guest. We have a guest. So I think I'm gonna knock out a couple of hours of work. I am doing some like TA type work for a professor. And then I also have work for my normal job that I usually work during the semester, but I'm doing that remote right now. So I'm gonna do that for a couple hours and sort of get my life together. I need to plan out my week a little better and um, respond to some emails. Are you ready to go? And then this afternoon, I'm gonna go ahead and work on some packing. I am not anywhere near ready to leave. I am driving across a couple states to get to Wisconsin, so that's something that needs to happen today, so that's the plan. I might need to run some errands this afternoon, depending. Mostly today is a get my life together, prep for the rest of the week kind of day. So I put together a schedule for this week. It honestly kind of looks horrific, and I'm not really excited to do all these things, but I'm gonna make it happen. And then I did a little bit of data prep like planning type work for my RA job. And now I'm moving on to some flex work for my job on campus. So it's really nice for my job. I work in the library. And one of the things they let us do is take online courses on sort of whatever we want. So currently I am taking a graphic design course to help with some cartography stuff. So I'm going to do about an hour of that. And then I just scheduled an appointment to get my glasses fixed. Um, not fixed but adjusted. So the other exciting update since I last vlogged is that I got a car. This is my little baby Benny. So excited to have her and to be able to drive her. Right now I am headed downtown to get my glasses adjusted. Finished lunch. I'm down in the basement and surveying what I have to deal with today. So I went through a couple weeks ago and sorted a lot of this stuff, but I need to actually get packing and putting things together. So I am just going to start somewhere and do what I can. Um, and I also have Queer Eye set up, so I'm gonna watch an episode of that while I'm working. And yeah, I'm just gonna put you on a little time lapse. Got a lot of shit left to see. Stuck in this town and the town's stuck in me. Always trying to find another reason to leave. But we sit at home all alone. So I've been on a little bit of an organizing kick this afternoon, as you've seen. It's like eight now, we just ate dinner, but I've gone through and organized like all of my desk stuff, everything that was in the basement. So it's been a long day and I think I'm going to have to quit now just because I've done so much, but I'm probably going to try to go for a walk, get some fresh air, and then call my boyfriend, watch The Office, and go to bed because I have another busy one tomorrow. Today's Tuesday. I am up early today. It's like 8.30 right now, I think, and I just dropped some stuff off with a friend and I'm at my high school, which is kind of weird, but I'm just here to use the track. I'm going to go on a quick run. For those of you who don't know, I am a pretty big runner. I ran a half marathon last fall and I'm hoping to run another big race in the fall, hopefully when races are back. I've been having some knee issues over the past couple months, so I've had to take some time off and every time I've tried to ease back into it after like a break or an injury the last couple months, I've just ended up hurting myself again, so... I'm just doing a little bit at a time. I'm probably only gonna run like a mile and a quarter today. So like five laps around the track. This should be pretty easy on my knees and hopefully will leave me feeling fine. So that's the plan for now. I have work at 10, so I'm gonna head home and pop in the shower real quick afterwards. But yeah, happy Tuesday. Run done. I am showered, I'm about to make breakfast, I'm gonna have to drink my coffee, which is obviously the very best part of the day. So I'm sitting down to eat lunch. I just have this salad with arugula from the garden and a really yummy green dressing my mom made the other day. 
it's I think like parsley, lemon, maple syrup, a couple other things, but so good. And then some doll that I made last week for dinner. One of my goals has been to read more nonfiction, but I have been sort of slacking on that the last couple weeks. I've been trying to read a chapter a day. So I just sat and I read one chapter and I'm gonna read a couple more of my book that I'm reading right now. This book is called Eyes on the Street. It's a biography of Jane Jacobs, who was a really famous urban geographer. So I've been enjoying learning more about her. Not feeling great today, but I think this afternoon I'm gonna keep working on some packing of like toiletries and stuff in my room and getting ready to actually hit the road, so. Yeah, I'm still hungry, so I'm gonna make my favorite smoothie. There's a mango. I like to put a decent amount in. Some spinach. This is starting to go, but half a banana. Sometimes I use a whole banana, but we have half of one, so I figure I'll just use it. And then I finish it off with a combination of coconut water and orange juice. And there you have it, the most delicious smoothie. Morning everybody, today is Wednesday. I don't even know what day of the week it is anymore. I'm struggling. I'm sure some of you can relate, but transitions like moving places or like starting something new, very stressful and so I don't sleep very well even though I like feel prepared and this really isn't that big of a deal. So I woke up super early this morning, did some yoga. I just came to pick up breakfast from my favorite restaurant. If you went to Penn State, you know that townies will always say there is a real waffle shop and there's a fake waffle shop. So I got real waffle shop this morning and I am very excited to eat it picked up for my whole family. This will be probably the last restaurant I eat at. I'm gonna head home now before this food gets cold and enjoy. Hey guys, I'm very excited. My camera copped out on me for a while there, but it seems like it's working again. So you haven't seen me do anything in a while, including eat my delicious breakfast. And now I'm out running errands. I'm actually at Plato's right now. I just wanna sell some of my stuff before I leave. I did not realize I had to have stuff freshly laundered. Um, I think that's just a new thing they're doing right now with COVID. So I'm probably gonna go home and throw the stuff that I do have in the laundry and wash it and bring it back. I was able to bring some shoes in, so at least I'll have that done with. So this afternoon I have work for like three hours, a couple meetings in there, and then I have a meeting for my internship after that, but I do have some more errands I need to run today, so I'm not sure I'm actually going to be able to make it to that internship meeting, maybe just a little part of it at the end, but we'll see. Really depends on these clothes and if I need to drop my library laptop off. Um, today or if I need to do that tomorrow so I'm running late to work but I just threw myself together a salad um with arugula from our garden tomato avocado and it just has like um sort of a lemon vinaigrette that I blended quickly and I'm gonna get started with work now for a couple hours I have a couple meetings and that's gonna be that So I just wrapped up work. I did a couple hours of work and had a few meetings, which I don't think I actually filmed any of it, but I just packed up my work laptop, which I've had for a couple months now and have to return today, which is kind of wild because it's been with me for a couple months and has turned into like my normal computer that I've been using for work and school. So, so that's packed up and put away. I think I'm going to go ahead to Play-Doh's now and try to sell the rest of those clothes I had from today. And then I'm gonna drop this back off and come back home and keep cranking on the packing per usual. Hey bud, just been chilling all afternoon. Any bed is the cat's bed, if you know, you know. Packing like a mad woman, but progress has been made. I literally didn't even remember that I was filming today because I was packing for like all night long. So I'm gonna pop in the shower now and then have a quick office sesh on Netflix party and then get some rest tonight because I have a busy, busy day tomorrow. Good morning, guys. 
guys it is thursday today i literally can't keep the days straight i was about to say it's friday um i'm back at the track again to do a quick little run it's kind of drizzly outside but i want to make sure i get moving today so i have a really busy day ahead my plan right now is to do this run and take a quick shower and then i'm gonna go meet my roommate for breakfast and coffee and then finish packing up the rest of my apartment because there's still a couple things there that I need to bring home. And then after that, I need to run some errands. I need to go back to Plato's to finish selling those clothes from yesterday that I wasn't able to. And then I need to drop off some library books, pick up a computer, and there's one other thing I need to do. Oh, and I'm gonna try to stop by the barn and say goodbye to my horse who's being shareboarded by someone, but I won't see him for a couple months. So I just wanna say bye to him and then and then after that, I have a three hour internship meeting this afternoon, and then I have to get my car ready, go get some gas and pack everything up so that we can leave early tomorrow morning. So that's the plan for today. It's gonna be a really busy one, but I'm gonna go for my run. Hands done. I'm tired, but that was good. I'm finally feeling like I'm getting my legs back, so. Very happy about that. All my stuff back there. Crazy. Alright, was wondering if you wanted to go for a drive. 